Yo guys, 2K3, welcome here, TPC Southwind, for the third round of the TPC Southwind shootout. Well, slime course, as we all know. Why don't we just go ahead, get our information and round going. So, we are playing off of the back black tees, hard pin locations, moderate wind speed, you can see it's around 12 miles an hour, and very fast green. So... I'm really hoping I ended up having to do a factory reset on my uh, headset, so really hoping that everything is fine in terms of the microphone. Everything I've tested actually shows it's fine at this point, so keeping our fingers crossed here. First hole, par 4, 404 yards, dog leg left, and again we get the wind pushing to the right, down right of the fairway actually. So actually, you know what? I'm gonna club down. So I really don't want this ball going into that rough. And instead, it's gonna go into the rough way off, even shorter. All right. Well, working mistake there, but it's fine. We can make it to the green here. I'm actually gonna go two clubs up. 175, very slight uphill. Gonna pr pr probably take a tiny bit off of this shot here. Oh, we are having a major slicing issue today. That was the right club though. 167, 18 yards to chip it onto the green. Ball's well, gonna be turning left as it goes. That edge is about 13, 14 yards. So that's about all we need to get it up there. It actually might have been my club face being open that may have helped with those initial slices, so. Oh, got the perfect distance to 2.8. And pretty much a straight down putt here. To start off with a par. All right, let's see if we can straighten things out. So we head to the second hole, par four, 361 yarder. Dog leg right, wind pushing down the fairway. Pull that a little bit. That might be in those bunkers or the rough there. And unfortunately it is in the bunker there. 119. Goes to 149, so gonna use our nine iron here. Get out. I feel like I kind of want to put this left to avoid that other bunker. Won't play this safe. I don't want to have more trouble. Oh, on the green. But this is not at all where I pictured I would be. And you know what? We're gonna we're gonna have the greenskeeper get mad at us. I'm gonna pull out the lob wedge here and do a chip. Uh, so two pin it's twenty. I probably only need fourteen yards again. I'm sorry, greenskeeper. I'm kind of a pro, it's fine. <laughs> See what we can do here. Get to eight feet. There's no way I was gonna putt and get it this close. Still gonna make it for the par. It's gonna turn. No change in elevation. Oh my god. Four. And unfortunately, we are end left with a bogey there. Fifth hole, par five. Third hole, excuse me. During the five, I, I've been doing that a lot lately. Third hole, par five, 566. 
And again, we get some nice help off the tea box here. Oh, that's a really nice drive. That should be perfectly fine on the fairway there. Big hop and great distance. Thanks to the wind, 326. We got 246 left. Gonna keep this five wood. And again, I'm gonna aim the slough, try to keep it away from the water, which is possible here. Nice fade on it too. On top of the hill, it's a good chipping spot, honestly. So we're now looking at the green, 22 yards to get down there. Probably wanna chip it about 13, 14 yards. Very consistent with how to chip these. Just making sure mouse is off of the game, making sure my game doesn't lag because of it. All right, where are we looking at? We're looking at the par three, fourth hole. It's playing 198 downhill into the wind. Now here's the question, because my five iron's been getting, getting extra distance. Do I go up a club or do I keep with the five? If I hit it long, I'd rather I'd rather hit it long over the water here. So we're gonna go up to four iron. Let's see what happens. I tried taking a little off if I could, but that was actually really good for distance. I just uh, pulled it a little bit. It's technically in the fairway kind of cut. And hey, guess how far we are? 15 yards. <clears throat> Rolling back up the hill. So instead of chipping that in, we're seven feet away. No change in downhill. Should just be pretty straight. There we go. Staying at even par. Heading to the fifth hole. Par five. 513 yard dog leg right. And the wind's actually pushing the ball back to the right. So that's going to help us on our tee shot here. A little bit of turn. Looks like it should be. second shot so that's probably in the bunker on the left actually made it over those bunkers yeah if that hit in the, the fairway that would have rolled really nice based on where we ended up so we got 22 yards to the pin I'm probably looking around there which is right right in that area letting it right down that slope so that's about 17 yards See what we can do with this chip here. Hmm, a little long, but it's in a good spot to go for a birdie putt here. 5.7. Yeah, that thing's not going to turn till the very end, so we can just hit this dead straight and be fine. 
There we go. Putting us to one under as we head to the sixth hole. Par four dog leg left. And the wind again, very nice. Gonna help push that ball back to the left on this drive. A little bit of a fade, but that's just gonna get pushed back to the left again. 270 something on the carry, good roll. Yeah, 292 with 159 left to go. Looking at an uphill shot here. Now it's giving us an 8 iron. And I'm actually going to keep this. Try aim it very slow. I did pull it a little, but that ball did kind of fade to the right. A good distance, but we're in the fringe. Oh, this is rough. Okay. Well, we could chip this in. Seven yards. Just need to pop this on. Let it roll to the hole. Oh, not enough pace. That was a perfect line for it. Three footer. Four par. There we go. After six holes, we are one under. Seventh hole, the par four, 480 yard dead straight. Going straight into the wind though, headwind. Come back, there we go. All right. Didn't like the line initially, but it did get the fade back, so it's nice. 282 on the drive, we got 199 to go. So it's a long second shot here. Into the wind, uphill, definitely gonna go with just a regular four iron shot here. That ball's fading a bit more than I wanted to, but that should be okay on the green. Yeah, we got an uphill putt here. Oh, what was it, 23 feet I think I saw? So this thing's gonna turn right? Am I right thing that? I had to think about that for a minute. 25 and a half feet, seven tenths uphill. So I want to aim just a little to the left, not too much. Too hard. Stop. I, I knew my pace was too much. Nine footer. Not an easy ask here. It's just like slight left. No. Didn't hit it hard enough, didn't put it left enough. That is a bogey, puts us back at even. Uh, heading to the eighth hole, it's a par three, playing 159. Wind's gonna be pushing to the right side of green. Oh, that's gonna go right in the bunker. Trying to pull it a little more to play the fade with the wind. Uh, so we get 13 yards. Well, it's definitely going to turn left when it goes up. And we probably only want about 10. It looks like 10 yards on the green. There we go, to 3.8. Little left, good pace. Sorry, a little right, good pace as it turns left. And a good par there. Heading to the ninth, staying on a par, 440 yard, par four, dog leg right. Wind's pushing back to the left of fairway though. And that's actually gonna probably be a headwind when we go to the green, but let's worry about this first shot here. As I pull that one, so that's definitely going to be rough left side. Unless I get a lucky bounce. No. 
it's very rough. Yeah, so we got 169 downhill into wind. Believe it or not, I'm gonna go just to make sure we get over. Especially with that pin position. Oh wow, that was still short. I'm happy that didn't go in the water though. Uh, we got 11 yards. Just gotta pop it up basically. Okay, that's a tougher putt than I wanted to leave myself. Let's do a bowl. And aim it just right. It's gonna turn left as it goes up. Three tenths up. 10.4 the total distance there. Oh, great line. Just didn't hit it. Very timid on that. So we end the front nine one over. As we head to 10th hole, par four. 461 going into the wind. So we're gonna keep the driver here for once. Oh, as I absolutely pull that, that thing is not fading back. Go over the second tree. Okay. At least we get a clear shot here for a second ball. Actually going to go two clubs up. Because again, we're coming from the rough into the wind. And if this thing goes a little right, that's fine. Because that bunker on the left does not look nice. Okay, on the fringe. Almost had the perfect distance for it. So we got 17 yards. There's a bit of an uphill. I wonder if this would be worth giving a putt. But that's a long distance. Uh, I mean, that's a 51 footer coming from the fringe. Yeah, I definitely feel more confident trying to chip it up there, so I'm going to go with the chip instead. Oh, that's... One it a little longer, that's for sure. Uh, but this putt, honestly, is pretty... pretty straightforward. There's some counteracting points for the line so I'm just gonna go straight at it 10.6 two tenths uphill oh okay I was worried the 11th hole playing downhill one's actually going out towards it so I'm gonna go to a nine iron and play this ball more towards the center. If it does fade, it's gonna be to benefit, but more left I am, the, the better I am. Oh, oh, nope. Pushed it. Really unfortunate. Do I wanna drop here or are we gonna re -tee it? Let's give it a re tee. Gonna give it one more try from the tee box here. There we go. That's the shot I was looking for. Way over. Wow, what? How'd it go that far? Well, that's an extremely unfortunate, uh, <laughs> Double water. What what just happened? Okay. You have 14 yards. It's definitely curling a bit to the left. And just pop this up and over. Let it roll that hill. 
uh, as we take our six shot. We need to make this to keep our strokes seven. All right. Really unfortunate triple right there. Twelfth hole, par four, playing three seventy. This one, thousand percent aiming at that bunker over there. Ball's gonna come back right thanks to the wind, anyways. And with the fade, that's just gonna turn even more. Oh, it's in the rough up there though. A little too much. So we got 150 downhill. Actually, you know what? I am, because of that wind, actually going to keep this 9 iron, believe it or not. Just aim it a little left and actually try to get a little left. Well, I mean, that should make it over the water. Yeah. Not, not the best looking shot there. All right, what do we got? 50, high 50s, right at 60. Turning left, straightens out. So if anything, I'm aiming very slight right. It's got quite a bit uphill to go, 57 points. happen any day of the week 445 yard 13th hole par 4 dog leg right going into the wind here that drive should be fine mid fairway to the wind so we're actually going to go to a 6 iron here, try to get that extra distance. Oh, I did not, did not have a good swing line I think on that one. That was definitely one, yeah you can see the mark, I definitely kind of cut back instead of straight. Oh man, 25 yards. Gonna go 18 to get to the green, and it's gonna turn left once it hits and gets on. Good distance. Keep rolling. Keep rolling. Keep rolling. Ah, uh, not hard enough. I needed more. If I said 20. <laughs> All right. So this ball slightly uphill, turning left. Definitely not the easiest of putts. 10.4, two tenths up. Can make it though. So get the distance. Oh, oh, talk about hanging by a thread. Man. Man. Alright, on to the 14th hole. 14th hole, excuse me. 233 yarder. It's playing downhill, but we are into the wind. So, I am going to keep this 5 wood, believe it or not. Actually, want to recenter it really quick, though. Again, play left, because I'm thinking about my f my fade it's a good play it might be short but it's a good shot all right well it is on three and a half to go so looking at this line definitely need it left this is gonna turn right and really what I'm looking at 
if I put that there, is I want it to kind of break down that part of the hill there. Three and a half, it's only two tenths down it's gonna go, so that's not bad at all. Oh, that's not hard enough, is it? It was, it was the perfect idea, though. I did exactly what I wanted to, I just did not hit the ball. As usual, that's really been my issue. And so, my brain is kind of stuck on pro greens, which is really unfortunate. 6.2. Oh, that, that did not, that did not turn at all. Not at that pace. So a bogey there. So five over, heading to the last four holes. Uh, 15th hole to par four. Playing 387 today. And tee shot. Gonna go to a three. It's really, I just wanna try to keep this on the fairway again. Let's see if we can actually do it this time. Nope, same as the first tee shot. Oh boy, so we got 155. Gonna go up two irons here. Really make sure aiming a bit left. Downhill. One's pushing down and to the right. It's a good shot, but it's got a lot of fade. Please make the distance. Don't bounce on the water. Oh, thank you. <sighs> All right. Can, we could chip this in. There is that possibility. 11 yards. It's going to turn a little bit to the right when it goes up. Oh, but I, I not, not like that. You got to hit it. <laughs> 9.3. Turning right, very slight, not too much. It's not really that steep there. Alright, good par, good par. Alright, let's see what kind of damage we can do heading to the final three. So we get to the 16th, par 5, 517. Get the wind to help us here, so that's nice. Oh, as I pulled that right into the trees, it's got a little bit of a draw on top of it. Oh, this is not a good look. 265? I have an alley. Literally, that's the only shot I can feasibly do from here. But I'm still going to end up in the rough, I'm sure. Or is that going to curl enough to get back in the fairway? No. Ooh. But we're not in the we're not in the bunker. That's the important thing. Uh, so we're looking 80 yards from the rough here, and still get good good a good green and regulation. Believe it or not, I'm gonna go up to a sandwich though. Take a little off. Oh, uh, bite, bite, bite. That was like nothing off of it. Uh, 19 yards at this point. 11 to there. I probably want to go about 14. Uh, pulled it a bit. So eight and a half. But I did give myself a decent line for this par save. If anything, it's like a right edge putt. There we go. Good par. Good par. 17th hole. 500 yard par 4. Get the wind to help us yet again. As long as we don't 
immensely pull it. That would be nice. As I say that, I did have a bit of a pull, but I was going to say I kind of got away with it, but those trees. Oh gosh. Uh, definitely need to go to a four. And then I need to aim it a bit more to the right, I think, just to make sure I'm keeping this okay. Surprised it didn't hit any branch, but that fade. Oh, that's slice. 181. 42 yards left. This ball's gonna turn left. Oh, yeah, that thing's massively gonna turn left, so. I hit it right at 44. Oh, a bit too much. Uh, so 11 yards. I need to go about 8 or 9. Turning right as it goes. There we go. Oh, save, save that one. As we head on down to the 18th hole, par 4, 383. Uh, do this, do try to. That's a little too much. Turn right, there we go. Oh, this feels so awkward. I can stay out of the water though? After all that? Yeah. Oh, we are more than fine. 300 yard drive, 154 to go. And on top of that, we get the wind helping us a bit here, so. Let's uh, straighten us up a bit. I'm gonna take a little off, I think. Ooh, I'm definitely pin seeking there though. Stay up. That's actually super unfortunate that it dropped in the water. Alright, so this is to save par again. Seven yard chip. Oh! He's trying to dunk that one. And that's one I can probably just aim straight at. This is for bogeyed in the round. Yeah, right in the center. Hey, look at that. 24 or less pots. Insane. Alright, so 6 over. I mean, we're not doing too badly. I definitely would like to get another, you know, something like round two going. Take a look at our uh, stats to end this session. Oh man, our approach game was terrible. The long irons were not doing us any favors, that's for sure. Tees were okay, approach was the worst, green side was a plus seven, Put putting was a it was almost at plus 4, plus 3.8. 6 out of 14 fairways, 6 out of 18 greens. That's, that's not a match you want to see. Uh, 25 putts, 84 feet. Uh, looking at our best shots. Oh yeah, green side. Green. Just littered with the green side at the top. Putts, green side, putts, yeah. <laughs> yeah, 3 of our shots. Oh yeah, because the 11th hole was two of them. And then of course the 18th hole. That was a really unfortunate pull. I was really hoping that would have faded back, but... 
what can you do, right? Alright guys, well thank you so much everybody who watched up to this point. I do sincerely appreciate it. I'll catch you guys in the final round action. Enjoy the rest of your day guys. Peace.